Hey guys, welcome to Improvised Chaos. So what we're looking at here is the results of another shape charge test I did. For this one I used roughly 20 grams of ETN. It was chemically induced melt cast. I take the ETN with a portion of ammonium nitrate mixture and I use uh, nitromethane and let it dissolve the ETN and encase the ammonium nitrate. The ammonium nitrate doesn't melt from the nitromethane and once the nitromethane evaporates off the resulting uh, melt cast is, is really firm and solid. You can see that I got some really good penetration. I, I didn't get all the way through it. It did split this plate that's significantly thick, solid, and um, we almost got through the back there. You can see the um, liquefied, I take aluminum powder at cart, uh, 3 micron aluminum powder, and I mix it with epoxy and will coat the bottom side of the whatever I'm using, the cone. This was a small white funnel that's used for reloading ammunition. And um, you can uh, tell that it doesn't really matter what you use as long as you have some type of mass and you propel it at a couple times the speed of sound and it's going to go through almost anything pretty nice so i'm going to show you all what i'm going to be using for my next test you can see i've taken two easter eggs one was slightly more round and smaller than this one and i sandwiched between them the two the epoxy and aluminum mixture really thick and uh, the tape is covering, there was two small holes put in so I could get the epoxy down and whenever you fill it so it can fill the actual void and when you press it, the air doesn't get trapped. Um, there's a couple aspects of a shape charge that are really important that I wasn't uh, noticing or wasn't, wasn't paying attention to and it's the shoulder, which is this lip that comes off the edge right here. And this, uh, this case is al allowed to slide down and, and rest on it. This was actually, I super glued this. It was taken off of a, a, another item. Um, and so those two eggs were then inserted into here. I, I'm going to, you know, tape this and reinforce this. And then we'll fill the back with ETN. And there, I was thinking about putting some more of the coating in here. But right now, the, if you were to cut the egg... The diam the inside uh, uh, the proportions are tapered correctly, where we have a thicker um, cone at the top, and it's gradually tapered down to the edges. So that's what hopefully what we're going to um, be successful in the next test. So thanks for watching, guys, and um, if you haven't subscribed, please do and click like if you uh, like what you saw. And we're going to be uh, going out to my property this this afternoon and I'll get some uh, detonation video um, uh, going for you guys. All right. Thanks for watching guys.